I will be with you in just a moment. What can I do for you? I have an appointment I'd like to check in. Can you help me with that? License and insurance card. I'm a long-standing patient with Henry Ford, so I should be in your system. That doesn't matter. They make me ask for your insurance card every time or else I get in trouble. Besides, these new computer systems are so irritating. I doubt I could find you even if you were in here. That doesn't sound right. How am I supposed to be comfortable with your new system? I don't know. I'm sorry. Okay, you're all set. Our providers are running a few minutes late this afternoon because of some unexpected patient emergencies, but we do have some informational brochures and magazines for you to look at. Thank you for your patience. Thanks, appreciate it. Linda, may I speak with you for a minute? Sure, am I in trouble? No, I just want to speak with you about the last interaction that I just witnessed with that last patient. Can you come over here for a minute? Okay. Linda, I'd like to take this opportunity to speak with you regarding the last patient interaction that I observed. How do you think you did with that? I'm guessing not so good. Well, there are a couple things we need to talk about, a couple opportunities that I observed. I think you did a very good job at least thanking the patient um, and letting her know that there will be a little bit of a wait. Um, the explanation, we have an opportunity there. We really don't want to convey to our patients that you're going to get in trouble or give them the mindset that their information is not going to be protected or their privacy will be compromised in any way. But the three components of AIDED, the D, E, and T, you did well on. But can you remember what the other components of AIDED are? Um, acknowledge, introduce, duration, explain, and thank. Great. Do you think you hit all those components? I don't think I introduced myself, is that right? Correct. Tell me, how would you do that next time? Well, I remember from the training um, that I should introduce myself in a way that the patient can understand. So maybe I would say, hello, my name is Linda. Can I help you check in? Good. What about the A for acknowledge? How would you do that? Well, now that you mention it, I was reading a magazine at the desk, and I know I'm not supposed to do that. I'm sorry. I also noticed that you have a, a bottle of open pop up there. We really don't want to have that in a patient care area. It really does not look professional. So. Sounds like we have a little bit of work to do on the A and the I. You got the others pretty much okay, but we really need to work on the A and the I, and possibly the E. What do you think we work on those three components for your evaluation? Sounds good. Thank you.